Hi everybody, good afternoon. Uh, I'm doing this uh, quick one, sneaky patch. A high volume system has been compromised. Security analysts, uh, analysts have detected suspicious activity within the kernel, but the attacker persists remain hidden. Traditional detection tool have failed, and the intruder has established deep persistence. Investigate live system suspected of running the kernel backdoor. Now they give us this system because it's kernel, of course, you go to the var log directly. So uh, <coughs> you can see we are part of the MD group, so we can read logs, so that's fine. Uh, be, because we, we go in, no, not, not you, because it's kernel. So we have to do this couple of kernels. So log, log, dash. Let's start with the first one before you go into the backup one. Oh, first one it tell you spatch model verification failed signator or a required key missing 10 tin kernel you, know, you can see from the start if we have problem there and then you had the uh, command root okay let's go let's close let's go to the next uh, to number one and now we can see the again uh, the spatch kernel uh, this is power the spatch model kernel his name is spatch spatch t c h uh, track me kernel cipher backdoor you can see the name is already uh, gave us the answer uh, so we know there is something gnome so if i go to mod info in linux mod uh, info spatch uh, ok it's uh, in spin mod info patch what is this uh, the file name is live model we can see where it is patch.co cipher is always root cipher uh, sr version patch whatever so we know the file so let's take that file uh, we can you can't uh, kernel you can just do uh, text on it it's not a uh, you can't. Uh, you can just do. Uh, no such file. Or ls library. What mean there is no such file? Model. Models uh, six point eight one uh, six house kernel driver uh, MICS patch oh it's patch dot co yeah it's not a text you can just uh, you can do this and you can see we can we, we can play with it for example one uh, let's uh, play let's try object dump for example uh, usually you do minus d oh, damn it. let's uh, get the name first uh, object dump for example dump minus d it will be too much noise let's do through less Why I'm doing spatch.co? Why you keep doing? Uh, yeah, I think you, you. This is usually if you want to, but I'm not sure we can find anything. But uh, oh, hold on, command output. Uh, now this one is more for deeper forensic. I don't think we can find the flag here. Otherwise, I didn't see it. The next one, what we can do? We can do uh, read LF, uh, for example, the file. Let's try minus A. Again, this is the kernel magic. Whatever, if you want to detail whatever you see, uh, this not to not help. Uh, hold on, what we did, what we saw there. After the zeros, why there was something? Oh uh, no, this uh, 
in the file. Okay, let's do same things, but let's uh, get a data section of the file. Let's say my p dot raw data. Is no raw data. Okay. Oh, my mistake. No, I shouldn't do space there. Okay, let's not do that less things. Okay, so raw data doesn't. Where is the d if we do the data? Same depth session data, no this session has allocated against it but have not been applied to this dump. Okay, so this all of this don't work. So let's go to the classic one. Our friend, you know, our friend, the famous friend for lazy things to do is string file. So string is our friend thing. So if you look, for example, here in, in string function, in the beginning of the file, it's not too long. Let's do this. <laughs> We continue less, so because we are lazy, unless with a, with a, with an S. Okay, you can see from from the start where the fail to create proc model uh, execute. So you can see is uh, here is the security give us the some secret here, and then uh, what was that secret for? I forgot about it. Uh, what I was thinking yeah you can see the echo command to proc cipher let's see what, what we have that uh, zoom in uh, cut uh, proc Cipher. You could command the proc cipher. So why let's do okay nothing there. Then they have uh, the secret. That's it. That is your flag. I forgot what uh, encryption this thing. And then if you screen version. If you continue there, this is our always root deploy session. What else? I forgot what the encryption for these things. It's not the uh, B64. <sighs> Try hack me. What you did to us now? Is there cyber chef here? Okay, let, let's continue. There is another thing. Where, where is that thing? I, I noticed it last time. Why is not here? Proc root as a patch that I see. So we can see the file now. Is there a cyber chef here? There is no internet. There's no internet in this machine. Let's uh, let me copy quickly. Uh, oh, it's from hex. So, so this is the flag straight. It's a hex uh, value. Uh, what I was looking there, we go, we go to file uh, root assess is patch, so we can go to vim root assess. Uh, I thought we are root. Cd uh, cd root. It's confusing. 
Who's root assas is patch? Get flag fruits as PW, that's the root folder. Okay, I don't know, but in any case, that's the a quick solution for this room. So you can see the secret uh, that uh, you go there, so that's your flag. So this one is straightforward. I thought to to analyze it, but rest are not uh, just uh, gibberish. So that's the way for uh, binary. So it don't, it's not important for us. So the most important now is this one. Uh, the secret is common to that uh, equal to proc cipher the process. Uh, I was looking for this file, but I can't see it. Home root. Which root are you in? Ah, I like to see how this room was there was done. PW root root is we are C D. See the root, there's nothing there. Maybe they put in the removed it when uh, they make this room. And then we have temporary cipher the text. Let's see that one. Cut temporary cipher. Oh, they just oh, this is just a message that is root. Get flag H9 or something. In any case, guys, that's the the whole. It's a small uh, forensic room. I hope you like it. And yeah. Thank you very much and have a good day.